Okay, Ivy, now is the time for a new spinoff that we're going to be working on called Unschoolers, Unschool Kids. Wait, hold on. I have to get the name right. Okay. Unschool Kids Ask Experts Questions, okay. right? And your first expert is who? Gamma. And so you're going to be asking Gamma expert, asking Gamma questions because she's an expert in what? Making doubles. And all things what? And, and all things yummy. And all things being what? Huh? Yes. Three, two, one, go. Ivy. Yeah. You all right? What? You all right? Remember from the the England episode? Yeah. What does you all right mean? Hi. Yeah. Hi. So you all right? You all right? <laughs> so Daddy is still in England, mm -hmm. and so that means we don't have a chef. Mm -hmm. But we do have a new chef. Gemma. Who's that? Gemma. Gemma. <laughs> Same. You and make Gemma. good food, so you're a chef. And Gemma is making what for us today? Doubles. Doubles. Gemma. Doubles is like literally my favorite Trinidadian food. Me too. Gemma. Next and to curry. curry. Yeah, curry which is good. Doubles still have curry in it, so. so. It's a merge of the two. Yes. Yes. I think bara is more delicious than roti. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Oliver. Come over here, son. Come here. Tell us. How do doubles taste? One thousand percent good. One thousand percent? Oh, that sounds like heaven. You tell me every time you bite a double, you feel like you're floating in heaven? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're alive experiencing the best parts of life. Mm -hmm. It all comes from Trinidadian food. <laughs> yeah. Did I just say purple pigs? I what? don't know. Yeah. Okay. Well, you're in another world. We in the doubles world. So we got a little taste test of the doubles, mm -hmm. right? And they are, well, they are, they taste like happiness. Yeah, they, they do. They taste like happiness. They do. Mm -hmm. When I tasted mine, I started dancing. It does taste like happiness. Mm-hmm. Tastes like happiness. So... Can you explain what a double looks like? It's like these kind of spherical. It's like these kind of spherical. A spherical is a ball. And it was, it's, it's like kind of in a disc. Yeah, it's like a disc, disc shape. Mhm. Mm and it has like little, well, like grooves and stuff. From it, be, from it being stretched. Mm -hmm. And it's really yummy. Oh, and it's also like kind of golden around the edges. And like in, in the more sunny you go, the more darker it kind of gets. And what goes in it? Curry. Explain to everybody what curry is. So... Well, curry is chickpeas that are cooked and seasoned in a way that makes them curry. <laughs> Meaning that it has certain curry spices like yeah. jeera and turmeric mm -hmm. and what else? Um, hot spicy. What? Like <laughs> or hot roll. Garlic, pepper. Or pepper. Yeah. It's for the flavoring. I am going to be. Why you look so shocked like you don't know where you, don't, where you saw and pepper in our food? Wait, mommy? Yeah? I have and 
infinity, 1000% fire in my mouth. I have infinity percent fire in my mouth and I, I'm turning into a dragon. I'm turning into the dragon in a game called Dragon Ball C. I'm confused. Oh jeez, Oliver, how many times do we have to tell you? They're not paying us. We don't want to get sued for using their copyright. What do you say? We can't repeat it. <laughs> oh jeez. Anyway, so the doubles is the disc, right? So the doubles is the disc, right? Mm -hmm. And then we have the chickpeas that have been curried. And then we take another one. Mm -hmm. And then we, and we eat it like a sandwich. Yeah. Okay. And then you feel happy. Mm -hmm. It don't take that long to cook, maybe two or three minutes. If I had more oil in the pot, I would have cooked a little bit. Yeah, I'm going to heat it up when I finish. This is still time to cook. And it's light. I just want to make sure that it's not raw. Anybody want to eat no raw food? Not me either. I'm gonna put a little bit. Uh, this one. Put your sesame oil. I know this is a cup of oil, but I didn't put a cup of oil. I put less than a cup of oil. So there's one. I don't know. I guess with me, with you know, grease. I mean. I normally didn't say use water, but I find the oil comes up better than the oil. The water? I do a better job. I can say mm -hmm. my favorite color is blue and purple. Okay. Now we're going to ask Gamma questions. This, this is Unschoolers Ask Experts Questions. Uh, so Gamma, what's the process for making the doubles? Well, I have to have a bowl. And I, it depends on how much I wanted to make. So this time I did, you could use two cups or you can use four cups of flour. So I use flour, turmeric, um, what they call jira, jira, jira. <laughs> some salt. I also add um, yeast and sugar. I had to put sugar in it in order for me to make the dough. So I had three cups of water. Warm water though. I add to it and I made and I make the dough and then I leave it to sit for 
one and a half hour until it dries. So to make out to make the doubles now, I have to use a spoon, a tablespoon, and spoon it out. I put oil in my hand and I scrub it as far as I can take it, and then put it in the pot with hot oil. But first, I have to heat up the the, um, the oil, like a cup of oil. I heat it up and I just turn it once. Make sure it's cooked. And I also make chick chickpeas, also known as chana. And um, I cook it. I put it. Well, I use the canned one, but you could use the dry one. You have to soak it overnight and then cook it. But I used the can, so it was easier. So I put oil in the pot with some um, fresh garlic. And then I put curry in, in like two cups, in a cup of water. And I put the curry to cook for a little bit in the oil and garlic. And then after when that like boiled down a little bit, I put out the can of chickpeas in it, which I use two cans of chickpeas. Okay. Is that good? Yeah. Thank you for explaining it, Grandma. You're welcome. That's, that's what Grandma used to eat in her days. There was, um, we either get by it in school, or we buy this Trinidad street food. People eat that a lot. They have it for breakfast. They have it for lunch sometimes. Because sometimes that's what people could afford. Even the working people could afford. That's all they can afford. And they buy that, and that's their meal. You put two together with some ch chickpeas and you get a sandwich. So we call it a double. But the thing we used to, we didn't used to call it doubles back then, we used to call it barra. Mm -hmm. The barra is the, is the flour, the flour mixed. And then putting the chickpeas and Another bar on top of it, it become a double. Okay. <laughs> Doubles. Thank you for explaining it, Gamma. Yes. If you go to Trinidad, now people are making doubles, but they're not making it like the older people used to make it back then. You know? Yeah. Yeah, now people are making fancy doubles with putting different things on it, yeah. different they're vegetables. Adding, yeah, they're adding. Well, back then we was just have, we used to have tambrum, tambrum, or either pom or you know it's what people have. Mango chow is a good thing. The chutney, yes, we used to use that a lot, which is the green mango, and we just cut it up, put salt and pepper in it, and sometimes they put it in the sun, and it stay there until. We think it's enough time to bring it. Some people make it ahead of it, ahead of, I um, mean, you know, ahead of time. Sometimes we make kuchula. You can't forget pepper sauce. Oh, the pepper sauce. Oh, yeah, we used to put pepper sauce on it a lot. Does that give you the appetite to eat? You eat more, more than, and it gives you good appetite. I love that. Pepper sauce. I don't know. It's a staple in Trinidad. Everybody eats that. Young, old. What's a staple? Uh, the doubles. Okay. That's something we, 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 we grew up eating. Okay. Yes. You might know a staple as the thing that keeps paper together, but a different type of staple is another word for double. No. Oh, wait. It's not another word for double. It's food that um, the natives eat. So that's why we said it's a staple in Trinidad. But this is something that we eat. Okay. Mm
we have them with our doubles today. Uh, chickpeas and maybe some tamarind sauce or some cucumbers that I made chow with. We can use that. Made with salt, pepper, black pepper. I don't have any um, scotch on it, but I use some crushed peppers to turn up the heat. Olive oil? No. That's the best I can get. No, it's supposed to be burning. The tambourine. Almost near the end there? No, mm -hmm. we got quite a few more. Yeah. A few more spoons. Send us your omelet order for wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey and achy. That's right. We have a new segment called Wakey, Wakey, Eggs and Bakey. And we're asking all of our listeners to send in their omelet orders for so that they can be in the mix for eggs, for Wakey, Wakey, Eggs and Bakey. <laughs> It's a little bit of a tongue twister, but we'll get it, right? Yeah. Yeah. So let's try this again. That's right. We've got a new segment. It's called Wakey Wakey Eggs and Bakey. And we're asking you, our audience members, to send us your omelet order so you can be in the mix for Wakey Wakey Eggs and Bakey. That's your stories, your comments, your questions, and tales of being an unschooler or homeschooler yourself. We want to hear from you, and we want to get your voices on this podcast, sharing your unschool pages of your lives with our unschool pages of our lives. Chat to you in the next episode. Is this the cutest? Yes, it's the cutest, just like you. Bake. Pigs cute. And pigs are pepperoni. And it makes pizza. That's pigs are cute and they're pepperoni. And pepperoni is for pizza. And my favorite food is pizza. It can be made everywhere in the world. In the whole white universe. In the whole world. Give us your gumlet orders for wakey wakey eggs and bakey. Yeah. Why is this this bed? I like this bed. I miss this bed a lot. And this makes light. I think that's the ocean. I feel like it's the ocean. Unsure pages of our lives. Subscribe and share. And like this video. Video. podcast video. Uh, curry. So tell grandma. Uh, 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 Do you want, um, what you want in your curry? What you want, Dallas? I just want curry. You just want curry. You don't want nothing else. Yeah. It's curry. I'll give you some curry. You want it in a bowl? Uh, Oliver, you want it in this? Does this good? Oh, that's all. The bowl? Show me. Don't go nowhere. Show me.